I'm Michael Forrest. I made Video Pencil and today I'm going to show you the best way to use it on your Mac. So with Video Pencil you can be in a meeting on your Mac and you can grab your iPad and you can see exactly where you're drawing. You can see yourself. So in order for that to work we need a way to connect the Mac to the iPad. So there's something in between that meeting and your iPad that makes that all work. So this is called a virtual camera. There are lots of ways to get a virtual camera with Video Pencil but I just spent the last couple of years building the absolute best way to do it on a Mac. It's called QCam Presenter and it automatically connects your Mac to your iPad and does all of that layering and then just gives you the virtual camera that you can select in Zoom. It's a free download and I'll show you how to get it now. So you're going to go to the website qcam.app, you're going to download that. You don't have to sign up for anything. If you click on that you're now going to get the this image. So you just drag that into applications to run it and now it's going to ask for some permissions. So you're going to say camera access, yes. We're going to give it mic permission, yes. And just sort of have a look at these. Make sure you sort of go through each of these I'm just showing you here how that all works. And then the next one, we're just going to install the camera extension. That's the virtual camera. So make sure you follow this open system settings, click allow, come back out. This is all Apple stuff. And then finally, we're going to install the virtual mic. So just click on that, put in your password. And then once you've installed all that stuff, just make sure you quit QCAM and then you're going to be ready to go. So now if we come into QCAM, I'll show you my desktop as it is right now. This is what QCAM looks like. You can see that Video Pencil has just automatically been found and automatically connected and we can just start drawing. And it just works as seamlessly as that. So now you've got a virtual camera that you can select in Zoom or Teams and you're good to go. That's all you need to know about QCAM if you just want to use Video Pencil. But remember with QCAM's dashboard you can draw on a lot more than your webcam. You can draw on your desktop, on pictures, on videos, on a second camera and more. I recorded this video with QCAM. And if you're sharing something you can even quickly move it out the way and keep talking and maybe do a quick sketch and then sort of disappear that back out of the way without having to deal with any sort of like turning things on or off. And you've also got sound and you do your sparkle wand as well. So you can find Video Pencil at squares.tv slash Video Pencil. You can get QCAM at QCAM.app. I do a weekly live stream app lab where I talk about these apps every single week, all the new features, all the different bits and bobs. There's loads of depth to Video Pencil, loads of depth to QCAM, loads to Shoot as well, which works with these as well. So make sure you sign up to the squares.tv mailing list if you really want to keep finding out more. And if you need any help from other users in the community, you can ask questions on here or you can just come to squares.tv slash discord. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy using this on your Mac.